I may have made a mistake. Oh, okay. No, I have not made a mistake. But that is really funny. That is just... Super green. Everything is green. They are platforms. Okay, so how do you know... How do you know if you're, uh... If you should be looking for one of those... Code things in one of these rooms? It doesn't look like I've re revealed anything here. So... I was hoping since that top one was like actually moving around and stuff, uh, it would it would mean that there's like a code in the area, but it looks like it always does that. Okay, so this is all this for a power node. Damn, that other place just handed them out like cookies. This place is, like, all that for one. Just one. Okay, well, one way or another, we got that done. Hoi. And I don't see anything else in this immediate area, so we can actually get out of here. Yay! Progress! Well, I guess maybe less progress and more just, like, we don't have to think about backtracking in this zone. Might want to go back and backtrack through the other zones next, too. Oh. Why did that reset? Okay, so we want to go down and to the right. First opportunity to do so. How often are cookies just handed out to you? Often. Um, so I live across the street, more or less, ish, from a uh, Whole Foods. And it's uh, real convenient walking over there. And, like, on free sample day, which is, like, almost every day, they just have free cookies. Constantly. It's great. So I just go over there and get a free cookie. Same thing with my apartment complex. If I wanted to, I could do a circuit between my, uh, like, the, uh, the main office of my apartment complex and, uh, Whole Foods and get two full-size cookies. So, yeah, I, I get free cookies often. I don't... I shouldn't. I've finally gotten below 200 pounds, which, like, to me is incredible. There we go. This, this little sucker is convenient. Oh. No! Okay. You mean to tell me that that isn't a gap for this sucker to walk? On the right? Alright, screw it. Let's try this. Yeah, that left wall looks suspicious, but... It... it's not? Like, it looks... it looks suspicious, but... you can't. It... it... plops. Yeah, I don't think- I don't know how to get up there. I don't know how to deal with half this stuff. We could... We could try and go up this. There's pretty much one place to go here. Ah, crap. I just came from there, too. Alright, back we go. Let's see, can I launch that thing into the hole? 
That's <laughs> that's what I was trying to do, and it it didn't seem particularly interested in working. We might need the the next level of trench coat to get through that. <coughs> Which is kind of frustrating. Uh but anyway, I, I missed a uh there's a there's a door going vertically in one of these spots, and I bet I can get through that. I, I want to get all the backtracking done now if I can. Up is a dead end right now. There's a zone I haven't gotten to to the far right. Okay. Just want to quickly handle every bit of backtracking available. Am I okay, Wander? Never. Uh, in this case, I've got, like, weird hiccups. I don't know. I, uh... I... I don't know how I would describe it apart from unfortunate biology. Uh, which sounds stupid and is stupid. Uh, but, you know, I'll just randomly start, like, kind of hiccup hiccuping. No idea why. I just will. Uh, it has something to do with, like, sitting posture, what I've eaten for the day, and, like, other things. It's never actually, like, a, a, a problem problem, but it's just like... Ah! One too low. Got, got to go further up. It's like, it's not always coughing, it's it's sometimes like hiccups, or uh, recently my, my nose has been uh, openly rebelling, and so I've been uh, dealing with post-nasal drip, which is like, it, it is, it is unfortunate, because effectively, uh, I, I won't have like a runny nose, I won't even really have much of a cough. And then my, my throat just suddenly gets, like, randomly sore, and I'm like, oh, good. And then it just kind of progresses worse, and then I start, like, coughing a little bit. In this case, I just, like, have a random cough? I don't know. It's weird. It's dumb. Did I straight up just never go up here? Ever. I... I guess not? I bet I could have gone up here at the very beginning of the game. Nope, never mind. This very much distinctly looks like a place that I had to be what I currently am to get up to. There we go. At least the enemies uh, in these sections have not been... have not been uh, particularly heinous. Oh, he's not dead yet. There we go. I think this is a health orb. There we go. Yeah, full on health node. Sweet. Okay, yeah, worth it. And now I don't think there's a single door that I have not gone into in this entire level. Perfect. Oh, collectibles. But I mean, it has made me significantly beefier. Which should make the whole, uh, you know, progressing further on in this game it's much, much easier. Because now all we have to do is, uh, well, I mean, so we're supposed to go to the right for progression. Which is what we'll do. I might clear out the area areas over there as well, just for the sake of doing them. Now, what we probably want is the... The lower one, because I actually don't want to do this area. That's just going to be that's just going to be time consuming. And possibly not very productive. Man, health's looking fine. I I realized going into that last secret area is like, oh I haven't actually healed in a while. I should probably fix that. And then we got a health bit. Whee! I should switch back to Trace for no other reason than because the drone is... No, the drone, I think, actually jumps just as high as Trace does. Gar! Special effects on this game are, are fantastic. And off we go. Along the whatever the shit this thing's supposed to be. I mean, it's like a full, almost full head. 
Let's see, we've been through both of those. All of those, I think? Because, yeah, we've cleared this place out. There might be a couple of secret rooms, but I don't see any unexplored areas. This one has one. So why don't we go down into that one, clear out that area, and then we'll head over there, this way. Isn't the head you talked to earlier, you know, the one that murdered you? No, this is, this is like the weird transportation head that they just keep in this creepy corridor for reasons. I don't know if it's like one of the same or if it's just like a weird snail transportation system. It's unnerving. Yeah, so this is how you're supposed to go along upper... Not upper floors, but, uh, flat ceilings. Who'd have thought? They explained it in the lore, but it's still weird. They explained their weird, weird snail locomotion system. Wild. Okay. Well, this is going to be much, much easier now that it, uh, I'm here with my, my full complement of weaponry. Usalka is what they're called. S Snailhead appears to be one, but isn't. <coughs> Sorry about that. Well... We don't have to worry about the, uh, the enemies in this area as much. They are pretty weak to the homing lightning beam. Okay. Pretty weak. Not fully. I guess the other thing I could do is actually just operate as this thing for a while. Hello. My horror beam. I wonder. I wonder if somebody's done the math on uh, which of these weapons actually does the most amount of damage, and and like what the exact parameters. Ow! Lava! 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 It does not actually hurt that much. Interestingly enough, I was like, "Oh no, I'm walking in lava." Oh, it actually doesn't matter that much. Okay. There we go. Knew I could get into this room. Screw you, zombie man. You're a confusing uh, hero in One Punch Man. And I don't even understand you in this game. English. Oh, the quick brown fox jumped over the lazy sleeping dog. What? Pray tell is a fox. English. Thought long ago is to come to the evolution's merciless twisting lever. Seems to be with us once again. Queen Elizabeth I has bestowed upon us a new dream. Come into my arms. We have much to learn. What? Those green bushes that attach to you are of great importance to obtaining a weapon later on. Corrupt one and watch. Will do. Uh, we might have to loop back around and get another one of those to show up. Alright, what is this? Is this a new weapon, or is this a drill upgrade, maybe? Orange! Bifurcating energy bolts! I... Okay, if you want to just shoot everything in the room. The one thing that I wish, really wish this game had, uh, that it doesn't have, is uh, shortcuts back. You know, once you've completed one of these areas... Wait... How the devil are you supposed to get back anyway? Oh! You're not supposed to come down here yourself. This is a drone-only area. Now here's the question. There we go. Let's see if I can get a... Uh... 
another one of those green thingamadoos. Yeah, these levels were not exactly designed to be backtracked through. It does a lot of damage, I'll give it that. So how many weapons are there in this game? Let's just corrupt it while it's on us. Ow. Okay, that didn't work. So I'm fairly certain I corrupted this. What's it do? It doesn't seem to be do any doing anything. It just kind of shrivels on the ground. And then dies? 20 weapons, maybe 24. Cripes. As a, that is an excessive amount of weapon. Well, we can always look up a guide. That is a cool weapon. It is weird. Okay, so the bushes might work differently in, in the different zones. Good to know. I think I still kind of prefer the uh, lightning beam. Okay, so do I see any collectibles or anything that I'm missing around here? Yes, there's one. There's one door I haven't been through, so let's go check that out. Alright. Eh. Close enough. Honestly, this gun probably does more than the lightning one, it's just not as accurate. Okay, so we want to go down. Double down and we'll, we'll see what we... <clears throat> we'll see what we can find. I'm mildly losing my voice. And never mind, this is not going to get us where we want to go. Okay, whatever, I can go up and around. I know where I am now. There we go. Yeah, this is easy peasy. I, f I straight up feel like I'm in a stomach. Although, like, weird cilia all over the place is gross. Okay, anyway. So we want to go over, might as well save while we're here. And then we want to go down. There's, there's like, a location I haven't been to there. And then after that... Yeah, so at the bottom of this room. I don't see anything else in this zone that I haven't completed yet. So apart from, you know, the miscellaneous uh, secret rooms that you can't get to. Oh, it's this one. I couldn't figure out how to get through this one. Let's try the bomb. Yeah, anybody know how to get the, uh... Oh. Well, there's our answer. Alright. I think it's just another health fragment. Yep, three out of five. Nothing fancy. So yeah, it was just a hole you could drop through. Wait, glitching these things out just makes them give you a shit ton of health? That's kind of awesome, actually. Not immediately that necessary, but it's cool. Okay, so we're done with this, this zone. It also looks like I've got more, um... I've got more of those, like, snake things coming out of my back now, because I think we only originally had two. And now we've got, now we've got a full four. Obviously still not a big deal as, you know, the time I spend at full health is kind of rare? I mean, if I really like tried, I could probably stay at full health longer. Oh well. Anyway, thank you Zayner for the, uh, for the three-month resub, watching through your old Vigante vids. Good stuff. I get frustrated with it about 30 minutes myself. Game is hard. It is hard. Oh, oh. Wham! Hello, friend bot. 
Yeah, the bombs are gonna make this room incredibly easy. Wander is now Dr. Octopus. I'm very temporarily Dr. Octopus. Okay. There we go. Yeah, they're a lot easier to hack in this system. Okay, so we want to go... Third door on the right. We want to do third door on the right, and let's, uh, let's go up. Or, let's go across that. There's something over here, over there. I think I needed to be able to, like, throw my dude, maybe? Can't really remember. Alright, and this is probably a spot for the beat. Beam, if I remember. Yeah, Doc Ock status already lost. I kind of wish it was a permanent upgrade. I I take real weak like um. I would take really weak little arm things that shot way less often. Okay. So he can get across here. Did I did I never get the Oh, you know, I never got Buddy Bot in here. I think I I knew it. Knew that I could get over here, but I never actually managed to get get through. Uh What? Unless Yep. I'm fairly certain this is not what you're actually supposed to do, but I also don't care. Actually, I can just do this manually. No, I can't. What the hell? Oh. Of course. If I can't... That's weird. That was, that was weird. Why even let Buddy Bot through that? Uh oh. Oh. Okay. What? What's the point of anything in here? Do I have to get over to the right? Like, I feel like I missed something considerable here. Am I missing something, like, important? Uh... Any- anyone know? There's something up there, I don't remember what. Uh, okay. I'm in Coor. Let me let me just look this up. We might as well. Uh okay, so it's the Kur floating enemies room. Tethered charge. Let's just pause that.
So are we going left or right? Where is he going? What is he doing? Oh, okay, got it. I got it. I should have I should have checked this, honestly. So we've got something up here. Yeah, I should have I should have I should have looked for this. This should have been obvious. A uh, lot of work to get somewhere. I'll swap with my bot. Probably here? I don't actually know if this is the right idea. Probably shouldn't have done this, actually. Oh well, this is fine. Where is this gonna drop me? Tethered charge, a field of charged particles on a unbreakable leash. So it's a, a it's a big old flail. I really wish those things would stop uh, flashing if you've turned on, if you've deactivated them. It's kind of weird that they just stay lit. Oh well. Anyway, got that done. Wow. Yeah. This. I wonder if I could have actually gone gone through this in reverse. Oh, but the laser barricade. That's why the laser barricade was there. Well. Yeah, I kinda wish I kinda wish it would stay out longer. Cause it, it rolls them, it does a ton of damage in an AoE. But it's also just real awkward to to control. Well, that's it for that area. Yeah, let's just. Let's just go back to uh, the most old faithful we can old faithful. I wonder it's a laser flail. No, you're not wrong. Okay. Wow. Yeah, no, better to just stick with the uh, the homing electric gun. Cause ho oh, damn, that thing is a lot stronger. Okay, so we might have like a corner we don't have that much left in this area that's... That hasn't already been explored. Okay, so we want to go... Up and potentially up and to the right. Got a bunch of save rooms. A lightning gun, boring but practical. I am all about boring but practical. Is there anything around here? No, it doesn't look like it. That's kind of stupid. That just skips us like solid half of the room. Oh, right. You're supposed to drill these guys, which kills them pretty quick anyway. Okay. So which direction do we go? It looks like all roads kind of lead Rome Romewards. Actually, right. I think I can just bum rush these guys with the drone. And it looks like the drone's HP does, in fact, go up. Okay, so I'm gonna head over to the left wall here, see if I can scale that. We've had a fair amount of luck, actually, scaling stuff recently. I don't know if there's anything up there. Well, I mean, we do have one solution. We do have the best solution. 
We have the high flying and uh, gravity defying solution of Wee. Okay. Wee. Huh. Face. Don't judge me. No. Or we're just over here. Moon boots. I cared not for your weird physics. I am Tars man. Oh, no. Okay, and uh, we. We. Oh, there might actually be something up there. We. 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 Wee. Wee. There's actually something over here. Ah, there's a power-up. How the butts do you get up to this this thing? Uh let's actually see if we can figure it out. I think I know I think I know how you're supposed to get up here conventionally. Maybe. As somebody with mystical, magical, non-functional flying powers, there, there's our answer right there. Alright, so what I'm supposed to do... Hack the crap out of that guy. There we go. I mean, obviously I'm using mad gravity hacks. But, uh, this is, this is how you're supposed to get to, get to this conventionally. I solved it! I just found, found it with... No gravity on. Yeah, what? What the? That was a new one. Huh. Gravity went back to normal. <laughs> Thanks, gravity. Ah. 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 I I'm not I'm not gonna say I, I I miss I miss the gravity hacks. They were convenient. No And I remember this area. It sucks. Ow. There's just a lot of these, like, little moth critters that just, like, bite your ankles, and it sucks. Oh, well. So there's an upper area up here, but I think it's over on the right? Okay, so it's over here. It's over here. Huh. There we go. I think I might have actually been able to make that jump normally. Oh well. Let's see, why the hacks though? Uh, because my hand hurts and I don't want to spend forever exploring somewhere that has nothing. I'd much rather whip out some, uh, some mad hacks. And... Huh. I, yeah, I'd, I'd rather... Whip out mad hacks. Oh, right. I can just go straight through that. Oh. Which means this is where I'm supposed to go. Wow. Alright. Let's do that later. But yeah. Don't actually... Don't actually need to to do any of these things. But I have more fun with it. Uh, especially when like a number of these have like skyboxes that aren't meant to be um like really seen. Hey, it's a save room. Okay, that's that would have been way convenient a long time ago. So there's still a there's still an area that I need to get to, but this is fine. The big room screams boss room. I don't know if this game does that. Like reconfigures a room that you've already been through and turns it into a uh into a boss room, it might. Well anyway, let's let's go check out that new zone. Got what, 20 minutes? Yeah, I guess I'm just committed to playing this tonight. Oh, that's fine. Happy birthday, Az Azrath. Thank you for moderating my chat. At no actual reward. Ow! 
Wow. Jesus. Okay. You're a forgiven creature. Ow, ow, ow. Screw this. Ah! No! No! Okay, that... That works a bit better. Uh... Eh? There we go. Yeah, it turns out the, uh... There we go. Uh... Let's try shards, probably, against these things. The flail might actually be stronger here. Now there is actually, oops. Trace, I've seen this kind of barrier before. It requires a special key to bypass. Physical object carried by the Sudrans. Okay. Are you gonna apologize for killing me earlier? Trace, that was her apology. I think I'll just go look for the damn key now, thanks. Actually, be easier to just do a vertical toss, yeah. Much easier. Yeah, okay, that, that flail is the best, best weapon I got against these things. Ish. Best ish. Still hurts. Oh, physical lock. I can't get through there even if I wanted to. No, more of them! I'm going to die. Nope, not going to die yet. Damn it. Why do they do so much damage?